Hi, and welcome to my tutorials on Euclid's Elements, Book 6. This video presentation is going to be on Proposition 10 of Book 6. In this proposition, we're going to give the instructions on how to take a given line, for example, AC, which has been cut into arbitrarily, arbitrary segments, and to cut the line AB so that the cuts or the line segments are similar. In other words, the proportions are maintained. So how do we do that? The first thing we do is we draw the line CB, and then we construct lines GE and DF such that they are parallel to the line BC. We do that using Proposition 31 of Book 1. And now, AB has been cut similarly to AC. In other words, AD to DE is equal to AF to FG, and likewise DE to EC is equal to FG to GB. So how do we prove that this is actually so? The first thing we do is we draw a line from the point D parallel to AB. So line DHK is parallel to line AB. Well, DHK is parallel to AB. DF is parallel to EG, which is parallel to CB. So in other words, these segments here, these polygons here, are parallelograms. And because they're parallelograms, that means that DH is equal to FG, and HK is equal to GB. Now let's look at this triangle CDK. In this triangle CDK, we have a line EH that is parallel to the line CK. So according to Proposition 2 of this book, the ratio of DE to EC will be equal to the ratio of DH to HK. Again, that's from Proposition 2 of this book. Well, since DH is equal to FG and HK is equal to GB, we basically take DH and replace it with FG and take HK and replace it with BG and we end up that DE to, sorry, DE to EC is equal to FG to BG. Now let's look at this other triangle, AEG, and line DF. DF is parallel to the base EG. So again, from Proposition 2 of this book, the ratio of AD to DE will be equal to the ratio of AF to FG. Again, Proposition 2 of this book. So finally, we have shown these ratios have held AD to DE equals AF to FG. DE to EC is equal to FG to GB. And thus, we've shown that the line AB has been cut similarly to the line AC.